I might be able to get up there if you help me. Great. I'll head across for a better look. Father, there's a gate up here heading towards the entrance to the mine. If you can get up here, I'll need your help lifting it. If. That was close. Try again. Oh, come on. You can jump that. Your knees aren't that bad. Atreus. You can make that joke. It's another one of those wooden troughs. I wonder how the dwarf thought of stuff like this. Aye, might be the great motivator of convenience. Why do the work when you can get wet stuff to do it for you? Sure hope he is here. Atreus. We seek information. I know. Stop acting like I'm trying to start a war. Yet you do not say otherwise. Others? Maybe we can lay this to rest a bit, eh? On your side, I will lift on mine. <laughs> Heavier than I thought. <clears throat> Thanks. Let's keep moving. <clears throat> from a different <laughs> angle. Looks like we found Darlin's mine entrance. Got some. Got something else for you. Sindri! What is it? Since you're currently lacking a light source, Sorry, and have no way of seeing exactly what untold horrors lurk in the dark. These will help. Okay, back to your exploring now. Off with you. Thanks, Sindri.
Hey, wait, what do you mean by untold horrors? That huge crane's moving this way. imprisoned in this mine. Ah, Dublin might have been as well oiled as this crane. I don't believe he'd lead us astray. You think the lad's too trusty? He is eager to prove himself. It clouds his judgment. Oh, 
I know you have more faith in him than that, brother. Another of Cavassier's poems. This is it. This is the mine. Intriguing. However, we're ill-equipped to do anything with it right now. The official entrance to the mine is blocked, but there's got to be another way. Maybe this cave will get us in. This way. Nice. Not a dead end. Come on, let's see where this goes. Smells like we're headed into a mine. I think I can hear the water too. Slow down, Atreus. Take care. Be ready. So, I think I found where those wretches were coming from. They will overwhelm you quickly. Stay close. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
Keep moving. Maybe we can ride this boat thing further into the mine. Worth a shot. We're gonna be able to get in any other way. Sorry. I know you said not to, but I can't stop thinking about this. We spend all of our time fighting bad stuff, and I don't get why we can't do that alongside Tyr. We do not know him. We saw his shrines. He's a leader. He stood up to Odin when no one else would. If he's done it before, why wouldn't he do it again? Images from long ago do not tell the whole story. There's a door. Once we get off this, let's check there for Tyr. It's gotta be close. I can't help but feel like you're angry with me or something. Ever since we got to Sparto Farm, you've been critical of my every move. If you don't think I can lead us, just say so. It's not your competence that is in question. Okay, but what does that mean? Consider your intent. This place is huge. Must have taken ages to build. Another door. We'll have to check that one too. Bird's instructions do not say which one. Nope. We're on our own here. Your question from before, about my intent. I intend to help the God of War stop Odin. And that means freeing him from whatever prison he's in right now. Brace yourselves, friends. Sindri? Oh. And be careful exiting that thing. One foot at a time, there are loose, rusty nails everywhere. Have you seen any signs of tear? As if I would navigate this maze of running sewage. No, I'm sure you'll manage that on your own. I don't know. The water looks pretty clear here. Keyword, Lux. How can I help?
fire's actually a disinfectant, so these are very hygienic. Till we meet again! Whoever wrote this certainly had an eye for detail. Look, there's a door just across this gap. The tier could be right there. Oh, the water's overflowing where you froze that trough. That's helpful. The water flows blocked. Sounds like you got the water moving along, brother. What next? Go! Get to the door. Come on. Tear? Well, I certainly don't think this is where Tear currently is. He he's gotta be here somewhere. This mine is huge. Atreus. What do you intend to stop Odin from doing? You speak as if you know his plan. I don't know his plan. That's why we're... Ahem. Brothers. With Thimblewinter underway and Ragnarok around the corner, Odin will be desperate. Whatever he's planning to do surely won't be to the benefit of anyone but himself. Exactly. Across the way, there's another door. Maybe that's the one. Anything illuminating.
Glad we explored. How many doors are there down here? Not to be discouraging, but it is a mine after all. Here. That is the uh, Did you see that over there? There's a broken door up to the left behind this crane. Maybe Tyr tried to escape. We should look. Outstanding! That overflowing water is burning the crane. Clever. Fully powered up. We're almost there. Go! Wait, where are you going? We'll return. There's another door. Defeat these guys and check there. now, shall we? I think we can go this way. A statue. Made for the Aesir. Indeed. 
and then stolen by Ulf Jolf the thief. You may need some special equipment to use this. up there in no time. That's it. Come on. Let's take that lift up. You can't be far. Okay, new exercise. Let's think about how Tyr's probably feeling locked up in his mind. If I were imprisoned by Odin and finally freed, Odin would obviously be at the top of my list. But I would just want to fight something. Anything. Even if it was just to know I still could. Tear? Whoa! What happened here? on the left wretched <laughs> <laughs> they certainly weren't tear best look around this dwarf didn't make it out. Is that a relic? Huh. Get out of here this way. Another 
another empty vault. Ahem. <clears throat> Little brother. Perhaps it's time no, we... No, don't even say it. We're gonna find him. <clears throat> Look, another door on the other side of the cavern. Let's go. Jump! We're above where we got off the boat by Sindri. This mine is one enormous spiral. I think I can hear something in there. Statue. Not just any statue. That stony visage hung over the entrance to the World Mill, built by Durin the Generous. I believe that's all of the rebel artifacts. <laughs> we can return to Brock whenever you're ready. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
Another dead end. Where could he be? Atreus, this mine is largely abandoned. It is unlikely. Here's here. I know it. Derlin's direction stopped at the entrance to the mine. We just have to keep searching until we find him. You said you'd follow my lead, and I say we keep looking. So knock it off. Watch yourself. I will follow, but I stick to what I see. You did not agree with me, but you will not speak to me this way. Are we clear? Sir.
What happened? Why didn't that work? The chain is blocked. Jump on. Should be clear now. Ready when you are. One more door. That one has to be it. We will see. Seems like we'll have to get to it first. Quite across. Look for another way. I think I see a crank over here. Atreus. Another mental exercise. Would one who spends their life fighting, such as Tyr, have any desire to prove themselves. The proof leaves a wake of destruction. But if the wake of destruction is a bunch of bad guys, why does that matter? You're strong, and you did the right thing. War does not measure the strength of a man. I hope one day you understand. is dropping ore into the water truck. Frozen. The ore's jammed and it's making the water overflow. That didn't quite work. Something else we can do. We still have to go back and check out that last door, right? Oh, 
to be still. <clears throat> Looks familiar. We're back in the spiral section of the mine. Did you hear that, brothers? I don't think we're alone. Ears open. Eyes up. It came from over here. There's a passage leading out. Atreus, do my words irritate you? It's fine. I get it. Brothers! Wait, is that light up ahead there? Hey, this might be it. That door's barred. They must be trying to keep something in. You don't lock a door like that to secure the spare bedclothes. I see what we must do. Atreus, your arrows. Ready when you are. Yup! Do it then. Trickery is this Odin. What game do you play with me now? We're not with Odin. 
We're the good guys. Those plates. I know you. God killer. Have you come for me now? Only to free you. Stay away. Rather let me try. Tear. Tear. Look, you know me, don't you? You... You killed Mimir! No! No, 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 no! Yeah, we, we brought him right back! You... Stay away from me, you monsters! Stop! We need him! What? That's the last 
rest of them. Let's find your son. Here, listen, I swear we're not here to hurt you. We're just trying to get, get you away out. From me, please. Take you somewhere safe, I away from you. Odin. Show mercy. This is my father. We help people. I don't belong out here, please. It's worse when he's angry. Father! Are you not a soldier? Are you not a leader of men? Master yourself! My son brought us to this place. For you! Look at him! You. Why? You don't know me. I know what you stood for. You helped the giants. We're returning the favor. We? We are leaving. Are you coming with us? you in the lake. You had a spear. I thought you needed a weapon. Walking stick? No. A kind thought, but no. Thank you, no. What? Okay. I, uh... I, I ran because I don't always know what's real. Sometimes there's a... There's no shame in that, brother. We live in strange times. Everyone hears him talk. We must return home. Feel that? A wind blowing from over here. Maybe there's an exit nearby. Are there names by which I should call you? I'm Atreus. You already know Amir. And that's my father, Kratos. How does the son of a Spartan come to speak for the Jotnar? My mother was the last giant in Midgard. Laufe? Laufe. I remember that name. She tried to help people too. She's in the light of Alphon now. You have my sympathies. wrath to free me well Ragnarok is coming I hope you knew that we thought you'd want to help you freed me only to start a war no um um so dear it's good to see you in the flesh again Namir what's become of you following in your footsteps 
Betrayal, indefinite imprisonment, execrable torture at the hands of the Old Father. You didn't deserve such treatment. Did you? I will say my view was a touch better than yours. We found him at the top of a mountain with tree roots wrapped all around him. The only way to free him was to... Oh, that. Highly pleasant. For all parties involved. Ah! You okay? The light. It's... It's been so long. There's an outcropping just ahead. The shade will make it easier on your eyes. Come on. You said Ragnarok is coming. Which means Balder... Balder is dead. Odin sent him to track down a giant in Midgard. And then he found Kratos at... Anyway, I'd promise to take these two to the tallest peak in the realms if they'd chop off my head and convince Freya to bring it back. Amir, speak of Balder. I was getting to that. It wasn't all kill this, kill that. Hey, we're back in the wetlands. Watch out! Oh. all violence. But you're the god of war. I left that behind long ago. If Odin starts Ragnarok, you really wouldn't fight? Not even if I wished to. <laughs> Before we go any further, the truth What is it you want from me? You, you speak of Ragnarok. Is it a god of war you came to find? Is that the tear you need? Atreus. I... Forgive me. I am grateful for my freedom. But if you want me to follow you to war, or worse yet, lead you to it, then kill me now. My fight is gone. Damage is done. No one's killing you, brother. Better that than to live to see Ragnarok. We do not seek war. We just want some answers. I don't know how to help you. It doesn't matter. The Giants trusted you. That's the tier we need. We need you. Good night's rest. And maybe some food. I think you killed the guards bringing me dinner.
brother. Perhaps now you'd like to finish the story? The sons of Thor attacked us. We killed them. Baldur tried to kill Freya. I killed him. But you skipped over how he fought and freed the Valkyries. And that the giants are all gone? And now they called me Loki. And finding the shrines the giants and... are gone? When we got to Jotunheim, they were all... dead. Dead? Do you think Odin... We do not know. I think we're getting out of here not a moment too soon. Whoa. What are those? Reinforcements from Asgard. The Ainuriar will want to investigate my disappearance thoroughly. Are they using the sky to travel between realms? Odin's got tricks up his sleeve we haven't dared to consider. They're coming down on neither Valir too. Will the dwarves be okay? The time for such concerns has passed. We must leave. Now. Look out! <laughs> Careful, brother! You're covered in black cross! been too long. I had forgotten. Beauty. Tyr, in your travels, did you ever hear the giants talk about Loki? I'm sorry. That name doesn't sound familiar. The giants are... were... very private people. Makes sense. Perhaps after a rest. Treehouse. Lord Tyr, you're really alive. Am I? I wonder. Okay. He's just tired. I promised him some food and a room to rest in. Ah, of course you did. Well, let's see what we can do. Please, come inside. Uh, we'll be right in. Well, I'll be. So, can we talk about what to do next? There is much to consider. We will speak in the morning. Oh, okay. In the morning. You hold still! Yep. Oh, much better. Thank you. See? Sleep tight, dear. I'm gonna turn in. Big day tomorrow. So, Tyr, sounds like promises were made. Let's see about getting you settled, shall we? If you'll follow me. Hey, come see what I got for you. I'm sure we won't be interrupted any goings on. And I'll arrange accommodations. I may need time to construct a bed for someone of your scale. Please, don't go to trouble on my account. Too much space would be unsettling. Do you have a broom closet? Yes. But it's where I keep my brooms. That's all I need. To be honest, it's all I can manage. All right. Um, some food then. Oh, nothing much. Perhaps some hardtack. Hardtack. Any sort of humble ship's biscuit will do. I. With a pinch of salt? Well, I'll see what I can find. left a tear, huh? Back where I come from, we'd say he's been through a few things. Hmm. So have we all. Well, ain't you philosophical. What'll it be?
What are you thinking, brother? I am thinking. I want things to be the way they were. Well, I'd like to claim a tree again. Certain ships have sailed. I just wish Atreus were not so... restless. I care only for your safety. I know, brother. But holding him too tight won't keep him out of danger. The lad's determined to make a few mistakes of his own. And I hate to say it, but I think Tyr might be one of them. I've never seen a man bro Perhaps. Pity Freya's... Option. I don't suppose it is. Trouble sleeping. Ah! Shh. You cannot sneak up on me like that. There's something I have to do in Midgard. What? Without me? I thought we were partners. We are. Just wasn't sure you'd want to join me. I'm visiting an old friend. Oh, I see. Or possibly not doing that, taking into account she's determined to murder you. She wouldn't really. Oh, look, I think it's lovely that you see the best in people. I really do. And I want you to continue to see the best in people by not getting yourself murdered. <gasps> but we need her. It's worth the risk. Is it, though? How about I suggest an alternative? Something much less risky, but maybe could give you some answers. What are you talking about? A certain old friend you haven't seen in a while. A very giant friend. Jormungandr? Did you find him? Why don't I show you? It's just on the way to the vengeful goddess who wants you dead. So it'll give us some time to decide about not going there. So you know where Freya is? No, no. I mean, yes, but look, let's just talk to the snake first. And then I won't take you to Freya. How's that sound? Glad you brought your key of Yggdrasil. I seem to have dashed out without mine. Huh. You got sick of having house guests that fast? What? No. I could just use some fresh air. Is all. Well, I hope you like it cold. Should we swing by your cabin first? Will your furry friend be joining us this time? Uh... No. I, I meant to tell you. Fenrir's dead. Oh. I'm very sorry to hear that. As wolves go, he was always... very clean. Thanks. I'd offer to give you a hug, but why traumatize either of us further? Okay. Caught a whiff of something awful near the Helheim Tower. Remember how to get there? Yep, just past the oarsmen. But that's what makes you think Jormungandr's nearby? I know what I smell. Okay, well, a lot's kind of happened, and I need answers. <sighs> Be off! <sighs> the chest. <sighs> Not so easy, huh? Shut up! <sighs> going on so father said I cast a spell when Fenrir died but I don't know what he's talking about accidental magic that is disquieting accidental magic's not all I sort of turned into a bear a bear including the slobber yeah but I lost control 
Bray knows magic better than anyone. He could help me. But not giant magic. Fine. We'll do it your way then, Sin. A huge venomous snake seems to much safer. It's venomous? Shoot the barrel. It's got soundstone on it. Feels good, right? It's great, Sindri. We're blocked. How'd the arm of Tear statue end up here? Find a way through, and I'll tell you. I'm on it. It is soundstone, but the path's still blocked. I don't see any more on this side. Hold on. Let me look around. Maybe I need a different angle. No way I'm lifting that. Maybe with some help? Don't look at me. Who knows where it's been? Looks like there's something hidden by the horsemen. If only I had a way to burn this. Yes, if only your father were here. That's not what I said. Oh, lift's broken. I'll fix it later. So, Tyr's arm. Your father owed Thor a blood payment. And, well, he got it. Wow, great story. Anyway, is that likely to happen again? Sudden, uncontrolled, bear rampage? Beats me. We've got company. Got my back? They're literally made of filth. I'm not touching- Who said you need to touch them? I like the way you think. Okay, here goes nothing! That's the quality craftsmanship! Nice. Uh, okay, right. I'll just... Yeah. 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 
for sacrificing so many objects from your bag of tricks. Well, you clearly need the help. Oh, whatever. <laughs> I think the lift switch is broken. You can fix it, can't you? Or does your brother have all the talent after all? Depends. Is your father all the muscle? If I say yes, you realize you're confirming Brock has all the talent? <sighs> there! Let's get going. Why are you worrying so much today? I just need to look out for the people I care about. It keeps bad things from happening to them. Freya wouldn't kill me. And Jormungandr's probably not even there. Besides, he likes me. He's only eaten me once. I had conveniently scrubbed that from my memory. Well, we're here. Told you he's gone. Well, have you tried calling him? Blowing the horn's the first thing we try. I'm not talking about the horn. Your mute you no. That's not weird at all. What do you think it means? It means we should have stayed home. Let's head back. The door's frozen. Maybe I can... So what was your plan anyway? 
Just stroll up to the old Valkyrie Council Circle and hope Freya's in a good mood? Well, now that I know where she is, yeah, exactly what I'm gonna do. Fuck. Don't tell Brock I cursed. He's unbearable when he's smug. Huh. Look, Alder tried to kill her. We had no choice. Not sure she sees it that way. Well, I'm not gonna ask her. Besides, they were your arrows. You're absolutely right, which is exactly why I'm recommending we don't do this. for one day. No way. We're so close. <laughs> oh dear. Maybe this is a sign. Don't be a baby. I'll catch you. Promise not to drop you this time. I... Fine. Just step between the realms then. You know it doesn't work that way. Though sweet vessel, I wish it did. See? Was that so bad? I sincerely hope I never have to do it again, if that's what you're asking. <sighs> My shop! Well, if I can't stop you, then this is as far as I go. I'm gonna stay and fix this. Suit yourself. See y'all! I don't think I can break this. I need to find another way around. You sure you want to go in there wearing the very arrow tip that killed her son? I'll hide it under my shirt. And besides, it's a reminder to be better. You need a murder weapon to be a better person? It makes me feel brave, okay? Is that such a bad thing? 
When it leads you to believe you can convince Freya of anything, yes, it is. I have to try. going. Are you sure this is a good idea? You haven't got a plan. Brock says some people run better on chaos. I think he's right. What makes you think that applies here? This is life and death. And this is Ragnarok. We can't just do nothing and we're out of options. Living. Living is an option. Okay, now which way to the council? As long as I go up and forward, I think I'll get there eventually. Yeah, sounds right. Need to destroy the sonic piece first. All right, just need to get a different angle on the soundstone. Man, if 
father could see me now, he would lose it. I wouldn't have to hide things if he'd just trust me. How can I trust you if you lie? Actually, that's a good point. <gasps> Maybe if you listen to me, could I not say the same? Well, where do you think I learned it from? Going up. Wonder what mom would do. Why don't you trust her? Why won't you tell me?
going the right way. Really wish I had a compass. Jump up! I got this, right? Yeah, I got this. Freya shouldn't be much farther now. Just need to look out for that big door. there hey come to your senses yet yes I mean uh, I'm not changing my mind ha you do have doubts huh? hey like you never do better than having regrets I'm not sure I agree with that but by all means keep going and you might find those too yep that's the door Just be sure to scream if she starts killing you. Thanks. I feel so much better now. Hey, Freya. What? Can't I pay an old friend a visit? Nothing wrong with that, right? I mean, just because I'm responsible for the death of your son doesn't mean... Okay, yeah. should probably avoid mentioning that. Is that Freya? Am I wearing this around my neck? The arrow tip that killed your son? That's a great question. Uh... I'm so dead.
Here goes nothing. You should have stayed with Sindri. Wait! Stop! Your father. Where is he? Not here! He sent you? No! He doesn't know! You shouldn't have come. He took my son. What makes you think I won't do the same? Better than this. You would stake your life on it. What do you know of me? I know you haven't killed me yet. So while you're thinking it over, why don't you let me go and I can tell you why I came? You mean to plead for your father, save your breath. His fate is sealed. But you know who's to blame for everything. I cannot get to Odin, nor do I need to. Ragnarok will take him. Yeah? Well, what if I told you that he came to Midgard? He came to us! Offered peace if we don't move against him! Claims Ragnarok's already been averted. He lies. Maybe. But if you know Groa's prophecy, you know it depends on an army of giants. The giants wait for war in Jotunheim. No. I've been there. There is no giant army. There are no giants at all. Just me. You. In Jotunheim, we learned the truth. My mother was the last guardian of our people in Midgard. And, and that's not all. The giants have prophecies about me. They know me as... Loki. I think maybe I'm supposed to help stop Odin somehow. But since all the giants are dead and you won't fight Odin, then you've already won. Why aren't we working together? Now that you can fight again! I am far from Hulk! Okay. Okay. But we found here. Maybe if you 
Spoke to him. Tara's alive? Yeah. We we broke him out of Sorto Farm. Impossible. The Nine Realms are closed to all. No. We opened up the way. We just don't know where to go next. But if we all band together... Enough. Enough! <laughs> Leave this place. Go and do not return. Go before I change my mind. Do not expect the same mercy for your father. Okay, so I'm not dead. I didn't get any answers. So this all might have just been a very big waste of time. Which I will never, ever admit to Sindri. Good thing I like climbing. Oh, thank Amir. You're all right. How did it go? I'm starting to think. Sindri, I told you I could handle it. But I don't think she's gonna help us. Uh, where's your necklace? Huh? Oh! I was thinking and I, uh, got rid of it. She took it, didn't she? Uh... Today was your lucky day. So, tell me. How did it feel to run on chaos? I... I just fixed that! I've still got my bag of tricks. If you need me, I'll be... Standing back here! Something else tries to kill us. Yeah, good idea. Hate to bring it up, but are we telling your dad about this? Since you've come clean and all. No way. He'd kill you. Right. 
Well, speaking of coming clean, I need your opinion on something. Something I've kept from my brother for a long time. I'll tell you on the way back. Come on. Do they ever quit? Alfheim Tower. You were saying? Long before you were born, there was an accident at the forge. Brock died. I couldn't accept it. I went to the Lake of Souls in Alfheim to steal him back. Legions of souls tried to stop me. I can still feel them crawling all over my skin. Thing is, I could only get three of his four soul parts back. Sindri. Brock just thought he got knocked out. I've been lying to him ever since. It's been eating at me lately. You have to tell him. He has a right to know. When the time is right. As should you with your father. That's not the same thing. You did a good thing. You saved Brock's life. I caused trouble. No. I made a choice. One that wasn't mine to make. What do you mean? A choice. I... I couldn't be alone. The other dwarves, when they saw him, they shunned us. So we left. Made our own home. Well, you can't change the past, but it doesn't have to be who you are. Let's go home before Father wakes up. That might be the best idea you've had all night. Trey. Trey? It's an... Shut up. So I'm not allowed to give you a nickname? Is that what that was? <laughs> Whatever, Loke. Nope. That was worse. Oh, and I heard it when I said it. All right. Shall we? Empty-handed. 
After Tyr was such a failure, just wanted now to... Now hang on, little Jotun. Tyr may not be everything you expected, but a failure? You saved him from a terrible fate. That's not nothing. And hey, maybe he'll be some help to us yet. Maybe. But Father's not gonna go along with this forever. He's probably already got our next hiding place all picked out. Well, let's not make it worse by getting caught. When we get there, I'll cover our tracks at the gateway and slip around back. And you just act natural, but quickly. concerns me. Do we trust the path they would put us on? I trust their wisdom, and this is the closest thing to hearing directly from them. You are certain the Giants would not counsel war? I said that they were wise. In my experience, that goes with being peaceful. Oh, little brother! Told you we needn't worry. Atreus, where have you been? Peen? Hope you're all hungry. I could eat. Is everyone as well rested as I am? Be right down. Is this sausage? Uh, sure, why not? I remember food tasting better. I suppose you'd like to try cooking for this lot. I accept. What? I'm sure that's where I'm planning our next move. Oh, so where are we going? Alfheim. Home with the elves. Alfheim? You hate Alfheim. Why would we move there? Move there? Oh, we are. Seeking information. The shrine of Groa, young one. Your father tells me you found it there. Groa? The knowledge keeper? Oh, maybe there's a secret there I can unlock. Aye. Who better than the seer who saw everything? Hmm. I wasn't sure you, um. Never mind. That's great. I'll find. Hey! Don't go forgetting this, what'll get you there. You know what? I'm gonna build a bigger table. <laughs> More for me. Here, you're really up for coming with us? I am. Whenever you're ready. Well, Whenever your father's ready, I should say. If my counsel might help you towards the answers you seek, it's the least I can do to repay you. Plus, I think it will do me well to see the light of Elfheim again. Hmm. That elf light is some good shit. So... Where'd this plan come from? Oh, from Mimir, of course. I was merely asking how you found me, and he explained the secret prophecies inside the Yodnar shrines. Fascinating. From there, we sent to taking stock of which shrines we'd seen, at which point your father recalled finding growers outside the Temple of Light. And now that we can actually go to Alfheim, the prudent course of action became self-evident. Nary a lost step for the world's smartest man. Even without feet, if you'll forgive the levity. I was always fond of our talks, you know? Aye. And it's good to see you a free man again, old friend. And thanks to you as well, Brock. These clothes do better than I deserve. Darn straight! And never mind what Brock had to trade the landlord to get that interest he'll see. For you. The landlord? He's not the landlord. <laughs> uh, 
Okay. Appreciate it. If I don't have it, you don't. He really did it. Tyr really slept in my broom closet. Is that normal for you tall, godly sorts? Or just the ones locked up for a lifetime or two? Right behind you. I'll meet you at the gateway presently, friends. Mind if I take a little peek at you? I promise I'll be brief. My goodness, what a strapping physique. Capable of an astounding variety of acts of violence, I imagine. What is happening? Uh, this must be the squirrel that tends the world tree. That delectable aroma. Could it be? Pardon the intrusion. Ah, yes. Amber resin. Delightfully nutty with a hint of squidding. No. Not one for gastronomic expiration, I see. Wait, if you're ratted Hosker, why are you so different when we summon you for help? It's a long story. <laughs> but you are correct. I am indeed ratted Hosker. The one you know as ratted Hosker is merely one of my spectral aspects. And a particularly nasty one at that. I consider him so far removed from myself that he's practically a different person. Speaking of... Bitter, would you like to come out and see your friends? Fuck off! I'm busy! I suppose that was to be expected. Anyway... <clears throat> now that I've polished off all this resin for you, would you like the seed back? It is the seed. Indeed. A seed of Yggdrasil, to be precise. <clears throat> Since my dwarven tenants performed their little reconfiguration, you'll need seeds like these to open up new destinations on my tree. <laughs> Your tree, huh? Yes, my tree. Here, let me show you. So that's why good Master Brock needed an alpine seed. Clearly you have important matters afoot. Perhaps as we travel, you can tell me the tale of your prior visit to the Land of the Elves. Sure I can. Alfheim was the first time we ever roam traveled using your temple. Freya tried coming with us, but Odin cast a spell on her. She can't leave Midgard. That's terrible. So then we fought our way through an army of Dark Elves to get to the light. You interfered in the Elf War. Not by choice. We sought to fill our Bifrost, and they attacked us. And the Dark Elves were covering it with their sticky hive stuff. When we freed it, Light Elves came back. 
We seemed better in Alpha. <laughs> Did they now? Where the temple is from here, but that's where we'll find Grow a Shrine. Broken history. Aye, not exactly an easy fix for that. Continue their war. Yeah, so much for things being better in Alpha. <laughs> Yikes. Thimble Winter hit Alphon hard. No. Storms have plagued Alfheim's deserts long before Thimble Winter. Living desert. Hold on. I hear something out there. Something big. It's in pain. Our goal is at the temple, not in the desert. Perhaps we can reach that brazier from above. There, the Temple of Light. Shrine is at the top. Good eye. Bye, Frost Eyes. Is everything okay? Aye, old friend. Just looting no one your chest. We'll be right along. My dad likes loot. Ah. Very well. Freyr never bothered returning to Alfheim, did he, Mimir? Aye, no. I assumed the fate of his own realm took precedence. Wait, Freya's brother? Yes. Cut from a different cloth, that one.
There's a barricade up ahead. What are those shiny rocks? Twilight stone. A rare material that can take millennia to form. Majestic, isn't it? Occasionally, the light of Alfheim will bind to a rock and crystallize, growing like moss on a fallen tree. Truly a wonder of the Nine Realms. Oh, I didn't know it could do that. More inspiring lyricism from the mind of Kvasir. brother. How was he involved? Long ago, Freyr of the Vanni travelled to Alfheim, where he discovered a once beautiful land devastated by war. Using his divine powers, he set about cultivating a tenuous peace among the elves. Did you mention how that peace fell apart as soon as he left? I was getting to it. You hear that? Oh, no. That's enough. Please. You don't need to do this. We don't want to hurt you. We do not have a choice. <laughs> 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 Mention how that piece fell apart as soon as he left. I was getting to it. You hear that? Oh no. That's enough. Please. You don't need to do this. We don't want to hurt you. We do not have a choice. Whoa! Is that a bomb? We're the ones who freed the light. <laughs> Why are you fighting us? We helped you last time. Atreus, focus. I hate Alphonse. <laughs> Behind you! Look out! 
Follow once we're inside. Not like they're giving us much of a choice. So your father said. I'm just naive, I suppose. No. Just an optimist, old friend. To beat to Freya, made by the elves. He must have left it here when he raced back to Vanaheim. What is this? A charm to ward off nightmares. In this case, there. Yeah. Well, knowing the elves, there are probably more tributes to find. We came in from the top last time. I didn't realize all this was even down here. It's an older gate, built to promote cooperation between the elves. But it looks like it's been sealed for some time. How do we enter? Grab that wheel and I'll show you. I'll go first. Petraeus, let me know when I've reached halfway. So, uh, what's happening right now? This seal is meant to represent the balance of the realm when Freyr was here. Light and dark, working together in harmony. How's that look, Atreus? Good, I think. Father, now you go. Unfortunately for Alfheim, Freyr couldn't accept his sister's decision to marry Odin. He returned to Vanaheim and left this realm to its fate. To be fair... The Aesir did set him on fire that one time. Hmm. The door should have opened. Are you sure it's balanced? Yeah, but the realm isn't. Not anymore. Father, try pulling it the other way. Yeah, yeah! And here, you keep pushing forward. Fine work, Atreus. Shall we? What's a Dark Elf statue doing in the Light Temple? That's just how they looked before the Division. The Division? Yes. The elves weren't always split between light and dark, you know. This statue depicts the elves before the war, before they discovered the power of the light. Solid light. Guess some things don't change. Stone briefly imparts a bit of light to your axe. That's useful. What's that sound? No sense in spoiling the surprise. Oh, it's the light. Oh. Oh. 
I've never seen the Lake of Souls so volatile. Aye. Fimple winter, you reckon? Of course. Making the light unstable. So the base of this light well, that's the Lake of Souls. Yes. Yeah. After yeah. the creation of the Nine Realms, fallen souls began to gather down in those waters. When the elves discovered its potential, they built this temple to harness that energy. A smashing success, to say the least. Many of them became addicted to their newfound power, and thus, the Light Elves were born. <laughs> Imagine our light elf friends would be less than pleased. Speaking of light elves, let me try talking to them again. They Best may... just to let these two do their thing, brother. <laughs> Speaking of light elves, let me try talking to them again. They may just to let these two do their thing, brother. On your left! Across on light bridges, but now the bridges are gone. I have an idea to get us across. <sighs> Lucky for us, swearing off violence doesn't mean he can't disfigure some architecture. This way, I'm trying to wait. He's just looking around. He does this sometimes. Ah, curious mind. Carry on. The temple looks so different than I remember. It was all broken and covered in hive stuff last time we were here. 
These elves use Alfheim's light to enhance the temple. And themselves, by the look of it. They definitely look more dangerous than last time. Oh, those were just the foot soldiers. They'll get more dangerous the further up we go. Great. So if these elves use the light to build doors and make themselves stronger, what do the Dark Elves want with it? To return it back to its source. To them, the natural resources of Alfheim are sacred, none more so than the light itself. Aye, the Light Elf's success came at a terrible price. Alfheim's once lively desert withered into a storm-ridden wasteland <laughs> soon after the creation of this temple. <laughs> There's more Twilight Stone up there. Here. Ripped apart by his audience. Well, one member of his audience. Well, Thor. The Twilight Stone didn't give you the right angle. Are you certain? Not a great idea. Oh, there, friends. Salutations. We mean you no harm. Tear, get back. The long and short of it. Aye. So then, which side is right? Rarely is it so simple. And not our place to say. This is an elven conflict. I said as much the last time we were in Alpine. Right. made a lot of these light doors. Mm. Fortifications. Aye. None too eager to let the Dark Elves run the roost again. Excellent. Let's continue our 
set, yes? Hey, that looks interesting. I don't think that's the way up to the shrine. We know. There's a chest over here. Oh, I see it now. Forgive my impatience. Oh, Ricky. There's got to be a way to keep your axe behind the screen, right? I don't mean to speak out of turn, but the white marble wall behind that grate. Perhaps your axe can reach it. Thanks, dear. My pleasure.
Let me explore. Do it then. Always meaning if you look hard enough, brother. It's all in what you bring to it. I suppose I'll leave you to it then. I'll leave you to it. I suppose I'll leave you to it then. Behind! 
I suppose I'll leave you to it. I suppose I'll leave you to it then. Jump.
I'll meet you on the other side. Whoa! Tyr can really jump. They spent it to see us. There's Twilight Stone on the ground. He's getting the hang of it. I've never seen the light elves with so much control over the temple. This bet's on us. We must have anointed a new temple guardian. Svartal offers a counterpart. The Dark Elf King. Guess he's in the light now, too. Door blocking the chest is gone. Now we just need to find a way over there. Here they come. Do what you must. Light up on the left!
your right. Come on, Kratos. Off your back. Father, over here! Here they come. Do what you must. Take fall of life coming your way! Over here! Here they come. Do what you must. Right side, brother! Here they come. Do what you must.
crystal stone make light bridges. Now the light elves wear them. Smart. <gasps> Almost there. Allow me. I dare say he's beginning to enjoy the vandalism. Pretty soon he'll be laying waste to pottery. Shall we continue? Well, at least we're getting closer. Look up. See? Feels even taller on the inside. Can't believe all this was down here. <laughs> ah, the door here. Why must they insist on these frustrating trials? You would know better than us, brother. I can't remember the last time I visited the Nords, nor do I wish to try.
Twilight Zone on that statue shield. That angle is good. Do you think there's any way to stop the elves from fighting each other? That prayer not abandoned the realm, a lasting peace may have formed. But now... Can we really place all the blame on Freyr? This war started long before his arrival. But he had the power to heal this land and end the war, did he not? He made his choice. The wrong one. For Alfine, perhaps, but not necessarily for him. 
Well, I suppose we're all entitled to walk our own path. Regardless. Stuck on the wing. Hmm. <laughs> 
Here, the last time we were here, we killed the Dark Elf King. That's unfortunate. I'd wondered what became of Svartliofer. We had to defend ourselves, but when he died, he told us we helped the wrong side. I see. Job, brother. This way. We're almost. <laughs> Do you still hear something wounded out there, Atreus? I think so. It could just be the storm. Perhaps we can investigate once we've uncovered a mysterious seer's hidden prophecy.
There, the central chamber will bring us to the top, once we find our way past yet another light door. Maybe if we... Allow me to speed this up. The angle should work, Kratos. Well done. At your service. Ah, oh, light of Alfheim. I could hear Mother inside last time, but I can't anymore. Her soul is one with the light now, united by forces older than Odin himself. She is at peace, Atreus. I hope so. When Father went inside the light, he said he... went he... inside the light of Alfheim? Yes. And yet here you stand, of sound mind and decidedly not incinerated. You must tell me, Kratos, what did you see? That memory is for me alone. But I felt only moments pass. Didn't feel like moments to me. I was trapped. Atreus overcame great odds to save me. One could but only imagine. Well then, Groa's triptych awaits. So, did you ever meet Groa? Many times. But she was plagued by constant visions, so... Conversation was... Difficult, to say the least. Huh. They've changed some stuff. Last time, there was all this high stuff up here. So many Dark Elves. I... All this time, I thought the Dark Elf came... I thought all the Dark Elves were... Tear? Yes? Did we help the wrong side? Hmm. Are you certain that's the right question? I... What's the right question? Is there a right side? Exactly. What do you think, Atreus? Is there a right side in this war? I... I don't know. Then perhaps you shouldn't pick one.
there it is. Ah, you all made it. Welcome. Fate's injury? Oh, of course not. You think I'd wash my hands this much if I thought that what I do doesn't ultimately matter? There's only one thing with any say over how we live our lives, and that's us. Hey, Sindri, wasn't your forge on the other side of the shrine last time? My, someone's got an eye for detail. Perhaps the Light Elves felt it looked better on this side. They do have a thing for aesthetics. Honestly, I'm as puzzled as you are. But it's best not to look a gift forge in the two-year. Very messy. Anyway, good luck! Strike true. Cool. Their deaths will be painless. Ish. Good fit. And Atreus? Kratos?
giants always did enjoy hiding their secrets in plain sight. Wait until you see this. Ah, yes. Here we have Groa's search for her missing husband. She was relentless in her attempt to find him. Meditated for weeks on end. Unfortunately, she found... something else. A vision of Ragnarok. Word of Groa's vision reached Odin. He sought her out, demanded a private retelling. That's the... I don't know what that is. The mythical sanctuary for giants. Curious. So it's in Jotunheim? I know some giants thought so, but Ironwood isn't anywhere, lad. It's a concept, a metaphorical paradise. It's not real. Presumably, Groa requested her ashes be returned to Jotunheim, while her soul found peace in the light. Difficult to imagine Odin respecting those wishes. Hmm. The champion? I think it's supposed to be... me. You assume too much. Aye. Best not to read into these abstractions so literally. Prophecies are slippery by nature. Although, some are more obvious than others. Ragnarok. Aye. The end of everything. So this is it. There's nothing we can do to stop it. There must be a way. Why else is this hidden? Look. Here. This is what we saw. It's you. Fighting in Ragnarok. No. I don't... What's this then? That's new. Asgard is destroyed? But the other realms thrive? She did. Ah, Odin's working off a false prophecy. <laughs> so then, we can win Ragnarok. We can beat Odin. We are not present in any of this. But that was Tyr leading the charge against Asgard. Plus, Hell's army was there, and the elves. Champion. Okay, whoever that is doesn't matter. But for the first time. We know something Odin doesn't. We just saw we can win. Tyr? I won't allow prophecy to define my choices. But, but we just saw No, you. Atreus. This is wrong. Come. There is much to discuss. We can't stop Ragnarok, but we can win it. If Asgard is destroyed, Odin will not be the only casualty. There must be another way. Perhaps we should focus on our egress first. Agreed.
I... It's gonna be okay, dear. You've seen what is to come. I told you I would not follow you to war, and yet here I am, dragging an innocent, innocent? elf and marching towards the destruction of Asgard. What choice do we have? There is always a choice. I will not lead you to war. I won't. I'm not that god anymore. I don't want to fight. But with you three, there is no avoiding it. Your path leads to countless deaths, unimaginable pain and suffering. Oh, no! No! Atreus! Follow oh! us! Hold on! Over here! Your chase! Oh. Sir. Hey, dear. Thanks. And I'm sorry about before. I. No. I am sorry. I should never have come. We shouldn't linger. I just want to do the right thing. And according to prophecy... Speak no more of prophecy. War will not give you the purpose you seek, Atreus. Only slaughter. So what are we supposed to do? Roll over? Do nothing? Enough! We will discuss our next move when we are out of danger. Oh! <laughs> 
go. Yeah. 
Can we leave now, please? Almost there. This way. Tear. We... Open the gateway, please. yourself the legacy this one has left for the barons. I've had far more than I can stomach. We do not need to rush. We should see this desert for ourselves. Look, I know we can't trust prophecy, but I'm not sure we should just ignore what we saw either. We are not ignoring it. We will discuss it back home. For now. I wish to search for the wounded animal you heard earlier. You? Really? Yes. Well, okay then. Good. Yeah. Lead the way. Hey. 